I have here a prototype of a silicon chessboard coming out. Now you may be familiar with the vinyl chessboards that have been on the market for years and years. And then there were mouse pad rubber back chessboards. This one is a prototype of a silicon chessboard. Same dimensions as a standard tournament or club chessboard of 20 inches with two and a quarter inch squares. The thickness of this one is 1.1 millimeters. Now notice how it's very flexible and can be made very compact. So think of the uses for that. And uh, being able to just throw it in your backpack or uh, take it along with you very easily. Um, of course, you could roll it up as well. And it will roll up more compact even than a vinyl board. It has somewhat of a sticky feel to it. But again, this is the prototype. And the actual one will not be so shiny. It will be more of a matte finish. Um, also, the colors will be slightly different. This is a burgundy. Primarily, it will come in a green, a black, uh, blue, and burgundy. And the white squares will not be so yellow. They'll be more like the buff color on this board right here. So let's see how the pieces look on this board. Taking a closer look at the silicon chessboard, 20 inches square, two and a quarter inch squares. I was wondering about the rubber feel. It's not, it's really not sticky. It just has a bit of a rubber silicon feel. So the pieces are going to be a bit grippy, and that's what I noticed. However, even though you can't slide the pieces, they do seem to grab onto the pieces, which can be a good thing. The question is, is it, is it really good for blitz? Seems to have a good feel to it. One point one mil millimeters thick. Let's see how durable this is. If you hadn't just seen me do that, you wouldn't know this board was a little bit skewed. But I'm impressed checking this out for the first time. I think the ink is going to be a lot sharper on those dark squares. Won't be any blotches, that's what I've been told. So um, I like this board. It's a good board.